Okay, I'm going to use one camera today because it's just a lot simpler for me and I've set it up to be on the uh, turntable that my horse's head is on and I'll just work on one side at a time. Again, I won't show you everything I'm doing because I do cover this in uh, my instructional videos on sculpting a horse. I've got one on sculpting a horse's head from scratch. I've got one on creating a a sculpture called Down the Ridge Line, which is a horse and a rider. I show how to scale a person for the horse. That's very important. You don't want somebody who looks too small or too big to go on your horse. And then I've got one video on sculpting a horse from scratch and that's a real handy one i also have a video on creating armatures for horses dogs and humans armatures are very important and uh, can make or break a piece if you don't know how to make a good armature they stream on video on vimo and uh, I give you a password that you can use and a link. And uh, that's good for as long as Vimo exists. And uh, I don't think it's going anywhere for a while. All right, I'll be right back. Just thought I'd give it a little self-promotion to start with. Time to play with some play. I'm just working out the uh, size of the uh, eyeball.
I'm not going to show you me doing the other side because it'd just be a repeat of what I'm doing on this side. And uh, I'm g just going to end it here, the video for today, because there's not much else I can do. Um, but just work on the the head on the other side. Um, I'm thinking while I'm talking here, and that's hard for me to do. <laughs> um, I don't think I'll be uh, videoing me working on the other head either. So I may be gone for a couple of days because I'm just going to go ahead and sculpt these things without worrying about the camera angle or the uh, working between the camera and the, and the uh, clay which I'm doing right now. The camera's right in front of my face and I have to look around it to uh, see what I'm doing. So I'll see you probably sometime next week and uh, hopefully I'll have both heads done by that time. And uh, so I'll say goodnight for tonight. Have a great weekend, everybody. Because I'm going to be working tomorrow on the other head. And try to get it done tomorrow, too. All right. Good night, everybody. See you next time. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.